right, ladies and gentlemen, this is a fascinating, very readable um, Victorian book, no date, but I think it's of 1880s, um, uh, book on um, the on anecdotes of the habits and instincts of animals. Um, it's an ex-library copy. It's fairly sort of um, uh, distressed, as you can see. There's, 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 there's the, the hinge is, is loose there. There's some sort of blue staining here. The spine is, is um, detached on the back uh, portion of it uh, there. As you can probably see, there's a bit of sellotape there. But the contents are all sound and complete. Um, and it's fascinating, um, as, as it suggests, anecdotal stories on the... Um, uh, um, uh, habits and the instincts of various animals. Um, we've got, um, where's the list of animals here? Monkeys, bats, moles, hedgehogs, bears, badgers, weasels, otters, dogs, wolves, foxes, hyenas, lions, tigers, leopards, and so it goes on. Uh, hippopotamuses, asses, giraffes, sheep, oxen, rhinoceroses, and it's um, stories of their, of their behavior, uh, patterns of behavior, um, uh, the fact that tigers are more easily caught in traps than lions, it says, um, um, uh, poisoned carcasses left out for tigers, uh, etc. There are nice uh, illustrations of various animals here, and it's all um, anecdotal and um, um, uh, 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 sort of very readable um, stories about the behaviour, um, feats performed by various animals, uh, their abilities in memory, etc., etc. And it's just a nice Victorian animal book, as I say, from around 1880, fairly distressed condition, but with a nice decorated cover there. Thanks so much indeed. Bye.